At Sentinel, a few of the better teams in the state provided quite a holiday treat. The Spartans welcomed Bozeman for a doubleheader, and the girls started with a game no one will forget. This one was so good, we don't have time for the first four quarters or for overtime. Let's pick it up in the second overtime. Bozeman's Hannah Wheeler is going to drill this three with about 30 seconds left, ties the game at 60. We go to overtime number three. Now less than a minute to go. Sentinel Shelby Swain in traffic, gets it to fall. That ties the game up at 64. We're going to OT number four. Final seconds now, Spartans down by two. Jordan Schwain gets that one to drop to tie it at 71-71. We're going to a fifth overtime. Ayla Embry gonna put Bozeman on top by one here with just under a minute to go. Bozeman would go up by two now with less than a second left. Spartans on an inbounds pass to Kylie Froelich. Her last chance just misses and Bozeman wins an epic in Missoula. Spartans fall for the first time this year, 76 to 74 in five overtimes. No way the boys game could live up to that, but the Hawks and Spartans do look like two of the better teams in the state this year. The Hawks couldn't stop Sam Beagley tonight. The Spartan star finds his spot here, pulls up for the jumper, and he scored 29 points against a very good Bozeman team. In the second, Bozeman's going to go to their star, Mac Anderson. Future Grizzly making nice moves in Missoula to the rim. The Hawks were up 14-10 at that point. It was tied at halftime. Then Sentinel takes control in the second half. A very impressive win for the Spartans, 50-35.